Okay, I still have to figure out what you think is overused. I know what I think is overused. Well, what do you think is overused? Oh, Enums, well, it's not even overused. It just is a mistake from the start. Enums in itself should have <laughs> never landed in TypeScript. Oh, um, they're so useful, though. <laughs> I would have I would have devil's advocated you either way, but okay, yeah, why don't okay, you like okay. Enums? So why do you think enums are useful? What you can do with enums that you cannot do with other existing TypeScript primitives uh, or patterns? You can do all sorts of stuff with existing TypeScript stuff outside of enums. It's just inconvenient too, which is a fact. I'd, a string literary types are very convenient. They are, but they don't have as good find and replace or rename or go to definition. De enums. Very debatable, and we're now touching territories that I feel passionate about. <laughs> we can't Excellent. talk about the shortcomings of the TypeScript language server. <laughs> that well, no, is a I tooling mean, issue, speaking, not a language issue. <laughs> a, 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 agnostic of whatever language server or service you're using, if you use a TypeScript enum, uh, mm -hmm. and you say, you know, fruit enum with, with apple equals apple, banana equals banana, cherry equals cherry, and you find all references on, let's say, banana, Mm -hmm. It will give you that. Whereas mm -hmm. if you have just the string literals you know, in a union, apple or banana or cherry, and you want to find all references on banana, conceptually, that doesn't make sense. Because what if you have other literals that just so happen to also be banana? So again, we're touching on something we should probably not touch on. But there are <laughs> tools out there in the ecosystem that differentiate between string literal types and just strings that happen to happen the same. And you can distinguish this. Just saying. Sure. But yeah. also, you cannot use, uh, you could use objects, an object notation for itself. Uh, yeah. It wouldn't generate the same amount of boilerplate that enums generate. And we could use counts enums, but then we cannot use isolated module. So yeah. 